Hello. Today I will show you how to manage students. After you log in, click on the Students tab. Now you are presented with a list of your students. You see their nicknames and the number of blogs they have created. You can send them private messages, change their passwords, edit their nicknames, or delete them. Bear in mind that when you delete a student, all their work, including their blogs, are deleted as well. Let's look closer at managing active and inactive students. Click on Manage Inactive Students. You get two boxes with active students on the left side and inactive on the right. To inactivate a student, click on Set Inactive to the right of the student. When you finish moving the students, click on Apply Changes. Please keep in mind an important thing here. Management of active and inactive students is limited to only one use. After that, the button Manage Inactive Students will be removed from your dashboard. Once students are inactive, they will no longer be able to edit, save, or delete logs. Only viewing of existing logs will be possible. If you downgrade your license, you will have fewer slots for your students than before. In this case, the same applies as already mentioned. You will have one opportunity to choose the students you want to inactivate so you have enough slots for the students you want to keep active. Once you apply the changes, the button Manage Inactive Students will be removed from your dashboard. And again, once students are inactive, they will no longer be able to edit, save, or delete logs. Only viewing of existing logs will be possible. If you need to make changes to active and inactive students after the option is no longer available, please click on the Need Help tab and let us know which students you wish to activate and inactivate. Please be aware that there is likely to be a service charge for this operation. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Thank you.